for City Live. I love visiting my friend, Chef Karina Coriel of Casey's Kitchen when she's cooking. Now, I made her promise to invite me to come watch the next time she made her gluten-free chicken parmesan. It is amazing. So the day that she was making it, I couldn't find anybody to come with me and shoot it with a big old video camera. So I grabbed my phone. I said, stop what you're doing. I'll be there in a minute. Take a look. We are making a gluten-free Parmesan chicken. So we use quinoa instead of breadcrumbs. We have um, two chicken breasts. I like to get the thinner chicken breast because it's about four ounces. And then that way you're not eating such a big portion. Because in your plate, you really should have the biggest portion as your vegetables. Okay, we're going to start out with a little bit of mayonnaise. It's all, again, this recipe is online. It's a quarter cup a quarter cup of plain Greek yogurt. And why I like to use the Greek yogurt is it really cuts down on the fat. We are going to add a half a cup of Parmesan cheese and we're gonna add just a little bit of hot sauce. We don't add salt because the Parmesan cheese really offers the salt that it already needs. So we have our Parmesan mixture and we already have a little bit of that ready already. And as you can see with one piece of chicken, we've already put the Parmesan mixture on. So we're gonna go ahead and put a good tablespoon of that on. And all you have to do is really spread it out so it's covering the full piece of chicken breast. And then we already have our quinoa cooked. I decided to get a tricolor one. It looks more like breadcrumbs, but you could use really any kind of quinoa. And we're just sprinkling that on to make the crust. It is so, so easy. We're gonna pop it in the oven at 350. And these pieces of chicken are a little bit thinner, so we could go a little bit less time for about 15 to 20 minutes. So here it is, our Parmesan quinoa crusted chicken. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. It was so delicious. That looks so delicious. And it looks like it's pretty simple to make. Well, the thing is, I very rarely go home immediately and try these recipes, but I made it that night. I went home and made it for my family that night. It was so delicious, so easy. You're mixing those things up. You're spreading them on the chicken. And then if you want to add some marinara sauce or something like that, sure. of course, you can. But we don't, uh, the daughter doesn't do the gluten. Girl yeah. child has an intolerance. So Chicken Parmesan is back on the menu. It's back on the table, if you will. And when you have a diet restriction, it's hard to find things that are that good and hearty to eat. Mm -hmm. And you did. And that looks absolutely amazing. So I think and I'm going to have to try that. We're going to get that recipe for you up on our website, as well as a way to reach Karina at Casey's Kitchen as well, because she prepares these meals and then you take them home to your family. Pretty amazing. Rance.